helping deliver babies and they take care of babies. And then got off work and then went home and took a shower, changed, and then picked up four trays of food. Uh, so thank you, love, for doing that. Uh, thank you for supporting me and loving me and, and um, being very, uh, taking lots of sacrifices to come see me in Fairfield. And uh, I love you for that. So I wrote you a little poem and I'd like to share it. Oh. Hard to believe it's been five years since we met back in 2009. From the very start, I knew I had to make you mine. Can't believe we met at a club called Excess. It was like seeing a GCR for the first time, and I couldn't keep my eyes off of you. Always been a debate on how we actually met that night. Not gonna discuss it now because it may get into a fight. We talked and got to know each other until October 17, and then it was official and you became my queen. We did the long distance for a short period of time. My love for you grew so much that it should have been a crime. Got lucky and was able to get stationed near the bay. Other than the deployment, we were very lucky, I must say. Went on plenty of vacations to places such as SoCal, Florida, Seattle, and different islands on Hawaii. You a successful nurse. I'm doing well in the Air Force. We're pretty blessed in our life. We have our own share of ups and downs, like all couples do. But no matter what, we always work it out because our love is true. You mean the world to me, and I'm never letting you go. It's man and CJ BJ always in prayers. You already know. I never ever want to lose my honeybee because my life would be incomplete without you. My heart belongs to you and only you, baby love. You were meant for me and God sent you from up above. I'm sad that I can't stay at Travis and must leave to the VA state. But all things work together for good for them that love God according to my faith. We already know we're going to love each other always and forever until eternity. We belong together, my love, can't you see? I really hope and pray that you'll consider coming with me. But I know first there's one question I gotta ask. Kathleen Jacinto. <laughs> 